Question number 14. Table 2 shows information related to 4 ingredients used to produce a type of biscuit. So these are the 4 ingredients, PQRS. And this will be the price per kg in 2019 and 2021. And this will be the weightage. So now let's see question A. Given the price index of ingredient P for 2021 based on 2019 is 130. So we draw a new column here, price index. So the P price index is 130. Find the value of Z. So you want to find the value of Z here. So we can use the formula. So 130 equals to Z over 15 times 100. So I'm going to shift these two over to the left hand side. So I will get Z equals to 130 times 15 divided by 100. So your answer is Z is equal to RM 1950. So 1950. Next, the price index of ingredient Q for 2021 based on 2019 is 140. 140. So here the Q price index is 140. And price per kg of ingredient Q in 2019. So 2019 the price per kg is X, right? For ingredient Q. So this will be X value. Is 6 ringgit less than the price in 2021 so that's the y value so here's y so we got two equations here first is we can form an equation using the price index so that will be 140 equals to y over x times 100 the second equation okay i'm going to simplify this what i'm going to do is i'm going to bring this the other side becomes divide and i'm also going to bring the x the other side okay so what I will get is y equals to um, 1.4x. Okay, this is what I'm going to get. All right, next. Um, the second equation, price per kg of ingredient Q. So this is x, right? So x will be equal to 6 ringgit less than y. So that means y minus 6. Okay, so this will be your second uh what is this second uh equation so this is your first equation this is your second equation so i'm going to take the first substitute into the second so x equals to 1.4 x minus 6 okay so i will get okay so i'm going to bring 6 the other side and bring the x here okay switch place lah. so i'm going to get 6 equals to 0.4x I'm going to write here so x equals to 6 over 0 0.4 so the answer is rm15 okay so yeah x value is 16 so if we know oh, sorry 15 so if we know x is 15 we can find y so y is what we use back the first equation so y equals to 1.4 times 15 answer is 21 rm21 so this is 21 okay so sorry i have to cram here because i don't have much space okay question b given the composite index so composite index to produce the biscuit so all the ingredients uh, combined okay so the composite index for 2021 based on 2019 is 132 express p in terms of q so this one of course we have to use the composite index formula okay so the formula is we got 132 right the total so 132 is the composite index so we have to multiply all the uh, price index as well as the weightage so the price index for the first one is 130 130 times 5 okay the weightage is 5 plus the second one is ingredient Q is 140 times p and then plus um, so we have to find the r and s first the price index so okay let's do separately huh? so the price index for r okay ingredient r I just write like this so it's going to be 12 over 750 times 100 
so I should get 160 okay then price index for s is going to be um, 880 divided by 8 times 100 so I should get I should get 110 okay so now I can substitute so here is going to be 160 times Q right because the weightage we don't know plus 110 times what was the value just now 3 the weightage is 3 divided by so all the weightage add together 5 plus P plus Q plus 3 okay so let me scroll down so we are going to bring this across here so 5 plus 3 here is 8 then you times 1 3 2 you get 1 0 5 6 plus 1 3 2 P plus 1 3 2 Q equals to so this one I'm going to multiply and add with this straight away I get 100 sorry 980 plus um, 140 P plus 160 Q so the question here asked me to express P in terms of Q so I'm going to make P as a subject so because of that I'm going to take this and bring over to the other side because I can get a positive so 140 minus 132 I get 8 8p right so 8p and then these two I'm going to bring across the other side okay so 1056 minus 980 I should get 76 and then 132 minus 160 I should get negative 28 Q. Okay, so since I'm looking for P, so I'm going to take 76 minus 28Q divided by 8. So P is equals to 19 over 2 minus 7 over 2Q. Right? Done. Alright, last question. The price of biscuit in 2019, so they gave you the cost. Okay, this is the cost. The price of all ingredients have increased by 20%. So if increased by 20%, we know the price index. The price index will be 120. From the year 2021 to 2022. Oh, okay, so this is a new price index. So, um, question C. This is from 2021 to 2022. Find the selling price of biscuit in 2022 if the company is targeting 15 percent profit so they're asking for the selling price okay before we find out the selling price we need to know the cost price first because all this we are talking about cost right so the cost price for 2019 is 40 and we want to find the cost price of 2022 before we can find the selling price so that means we, are, we have to use this the price index right because this price index is from 2021 to 2022 so we're going to write the year first 2019 to 2020 to 2020 eh, sorry 2019 to 2021 to 2022 because so far based on the table we are solving for this 2019 to 2021 so we have already found the price index right we can use the composite index from 2019 to 2021 is 132 and then from 2021 to 2022 is given by 20%. So the composite index will be 120. Okay. So now we have to find this. We have to find from 2019 to 2022. Why we want to find that? Because we want to find the cost price of 2022. And we have the 2019 cost price. So we have to use the price index formula. So before we can use that, we have to first find the price index first for 2022 based on 2019 if you don't understand then might just follow me uh, we'll go through it okay so how do we solve this we want to find the price index here the sorry the composite index so we can we can get okay, 2022 based on 2019 equals to so just take this times this divide by 100 you will get this okay so 132 times 120 divide by 100 so the answer here should be 
158.4. So the composite index, or you can say the price index for all the ingredients from 2019 to 2022 is this 158.4. Now we want to find the cost price for 2022. So we use the price index formula. So price index we already found. We're going to use this, the composite one. So 158.4 equals to so the cost of we don't know the cost right 2022 we need to find this first over the cost of 2019 is given so it's 40 times 100 okay so from here we can find the cost of 2022 which is uh, 158.4 times 40 divided by 100 so you should get your answer, RM 63.36. So this is the cost, okay? This is the cost. So if you want to find the selling price, okay, I'm going to use space here. Let me erase the top one. Okay, if you want to find the selling price, you know that the profit is 15%, right? So that means the selling price has to be 15% higher than the cost price because you want to make profit of 15. So the selling price is going to be the cost price which is 63.36 multiply by 15% right you want to get 15% extra so it's 115 over 100 okay because you want to increase by 15% so it's 115 over 100 so your price is going to be rm 72.86 so this is your answer